Um, how did you end up then at HSC in Petersburg? Uh, I was here in the last year in September for, for the winter school which was organized by, the, by Dietmar Wolf, one of the professors and uh, I, so much, I was really impressed because uh, the professors seemed to be really competent and it was, it was really interesting to be here so I decided that I want to come back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How come that he came to study at HSA? I had a bit about St. Petersburg uh, precisely uh, National Research University uh, when I searched some uh, I searched through the internet and I had a couple of uh, recommendations from some of my educationists uh, in my university. How did you come to study at HSC? Uh, so this is actually my second year here in HSC and uh, um, I just like to do it as all students, I had um, I applied through the website of HSC. I, I think it's enough clear to do everything there. It's in English language and so on, so you can apply. I applied online and I put all my certificates there, and and I uh, like they. I keep in touch with uh, the international office. And how do you like that? How, how is the standard of teaching? Uh, it's quite good, especially because we are in a quite we are working quite small groups. We have a lot of presentations, so I don't know, I like that kind of work. Mm -hmm. Who studies together with you? Where do people come from? Oh, I have a couple of uh, uh, African friends who are actually studying with me. Most of them also studied uh, history at the bachelor's level way back in our country. And a couple of them also studied in finance and others uh, politics and yes, other courses, yeah. What's your favorite thing about studying here at HC? Oh, about studying? Mm -hmm. Oh, that, that's an interesting question. What's my favorite thing about studying? I think just, just to have this, um, this international context so that there's so many different people and you can talk to people from everywhere. I really like this. Do you think it's hard to study here? For me, it's, it's not about hard or, or easy, but it's like, how, how, how is it? So. Uh, so actually I had a lot of presentations, a lot of reports and a lot of group projects. Do you live in the dorm now, in the student dormitory? Mm, yeah, I do. I, I, I live at the International Hostel. It's actually at uh, Zaporozhka, if I'm not wrong with the pronunciation. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's where I live right now. How do you like it there? Mm. It's very wonderful, wonderful place actually. Uh, convenient facilities. Uh, where do you live now? Where did you live before? I started living in a book of her in the dorms, but I moved out because it was a little bit too far away from me and I prefer living on my own. Now I live uh, in a little flat in Chernichevskaya. Okay, how, was the, the, how were the conditions in the dorm? And all that? They're actually quite lovely. The showers were amazing. Uh, I just, that's one of the big things I miss. Like really, the showers were amazing. <laughs> um, people were pretty friendly there. Um, the administrators were pretty chill. How do you like Russian people here at university? At the beginning, the Russian people see maybe a little bit cold but once you know them better they're really open and helpful and supporting you and everything I can say.